Hello everyone, William here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to master bottle for answers. So, it's very simple. So the first thing we want to do is get all of the assets we need in the same folder. So here I created, um, so I've got the tutorial building over here. And then here we've got the t-shirt we made during the t-shirt tutorial. So all of that in a nice bundle folder. So now, what, what we can do now is actually set up the export for it. So I already did that right here. So I put that in a, in a map, in my test map. So I just have to, when I go in here, you had it folder called bundles and then you want to copy the file structure in there so what I'm saying by that is that here if I open this folder here the first thing we have is the bundle if I go back here we've got bundle if we open that we've got Xmas and Yunsu and if we open this one we've got the exact same stuff so you want to make sure the folder structure is the same now, what we want to do here is we can actually set up these dat files. So it's very easy. So you just do like you normally do. You copy one from the vanilla game. Just remove the QID, set a new ID, and this time it's you don't have to put the exclude from master bundle line at the bottom because you are actually using a master bundle. So all of that is fine. Now, you also have this file right here, which is important. So, if I open that, we can see over here we've got the asset bundle name, the asset prefix, and the asset bundle version. So, this line, we don't really care about it. We don't have to touch it. But now here, this line and this line, I'm going to show you how to set that up. So, first of all, we need to find this uh, file here. So, that's rather easy so what we're going to do is if i just lower this um let's go in unity and so let's leave unity here now let's go in steam so we're going to go properties and local fonts and browse close this now okay so it's very easy to find it it's right here bundles and then it's right over here so now i'm gonna copy this and paste it right here now, let's say I open this, okay? It looks like there's more stuff. But here, if we've got the comments, so we can actually remove this. Here, it just tells what to do. So here, it says, it's the path to the asset bundle in Unity. And there, it says that the folders in Unity should be the same as the, the one containing the dat files. So, nothing big here. So now, that's the default setup here. So now we want to get back in Unity here, and let's go back in here. So now if I take back this, but it, it asks us for some stuff here. Asset prefix. See, assets is right here in the project tab, and then here it says core master bundle, because normally in on turn it's right here, so with all the stuff. But here in our case it's called tutorial. So we're going to take this and rename that to tutorial. So the folder our stuff is in. And now here, I've actually used this right here. So you just have to remove core and place it by the name of yourself. So I'm going to use YouTube test. Now you can just copy this line here. I don't have to say that. Right? Now, if I go back in and see with the inspector open, you can go right over here select like this tutorial folder and then down here in the asset bundle just click here on the none click new you paste and you press enter now we've got a new master bundle and we can go here and set it to you can put it like on here too if you want but it's not that necessary now we want to open the export tool so right here windows unturned and then mass bond 
Now let's put that right here. Now if we open this, we've got the master bundle which is created. Now if we go all the way down to the bottom here, we can open this and we can actually set it on multi-platform. Now let's open this. Let's say it's set over here, okay? So by default, it's gonna be set not to where you want to bundle it. So it's gonna say that the path does not contain the master bundle of that. So now you click on the dots here. Now I'll go in maps, and then test, and then bundles, which is where our stuff is, and then select folder. Now the message disappear. Let's see that I go back in one folder more. It says does not because I'm in the wrong one. So make sure you select the correct one. And now we're actually ready to go. Now we can just export this. So now it's gonna export our mod. Depending on the size of it, it can take hours or like in the or it can be really short over here as we can see. If I go back in Unity over here I don't see any more stuff loading but we see here we've got a bunch more stuff and for some reason it deleted um, the files I set up so let me just fix that real quick okay so I remade the files that were that got deleted so I've got everything back in here so make sure when you make this you have the English that that which contains the name the description and everything and then you've got the main dot that that contains the information about the object or item make sure the name of it is the same as the folder it's placed in so now what we can do is I can actually close this and now we're not going to need this anymore we don't need unity in either so I can just go in here and we can just start up on turn right over here and I'll see you guys as soon as it's open so the game just finally opened so now it's time for the testing so I used the ID 17,100 so now let's first go right here on the test map in the map editor so let's go and level here object and we can just search, search up for mass tutorial which is right over here as you can see it works perfectly over here so that's good for us see so it's still working, still the same missing face as the last time. So we can actually save this. Now if I go play, yeah, there's a lot of map here. Let's just reset this real quick. Now if I hit play, we can see right here we've got the building all working and everything. Now. Let's go naked here. Now we can spawn in our amazing Christmas shirt right here. It looks incredible. So there you go guys, you have it. The Master Bundle Tutorial. So make sure to subscribe to not miss out any for tutorial uh, coming. You can also join my Discord in the description. It's very useful if you need help for anything. And on that, I'll see you guys in the next video.